You're watching The View. Let's get ready to rumble! Hello, hello, hello. This is The View. I'm Whoopi Goldberg, and I'm as surprised as you that this is a show is a fit for me. <laughs> Later, we'll be talking toes. Why so nasty? <laughs> but up first, today's hot topics. President Trump tweeted that he is considering dumping illegal immigrants into sanctuary cities. Are these the type of policies we can look forward to now that Kirsten Nielsen is out? Abby Huntsman, we'll start with you. You want to start with me? Uh, OK. Uh, Homeland Secretary Kirsten Nielsen will always be known as the lady who puts kids in cages. And as a human mother, I don't like that. <laughs> but as a conservative daughter, I got to ask, why are we ignoring the weird J in Kirsten's name? <laughs> and what else is she hiding? Oop, did I talk too long, Whoopi? You did good, Abby. You did good, Abby. OK, is it my turn? Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, hot take alert. Uh, I don't like Trump. Trump, Trump, what a chump. Trump, Trump, what a dump. OK, look, it's my 2000th show at this point. I get paid by the word. Uh, uh, Mr. Trump, what are you doing to families at the border? It is shameful. It is nasty. It is broccoli in the microwave. I don't like it. I don't want to see it because it is shameful. It is nasty. It is. Oh, no, I got stuck in a loop. Sorry. OK, okay. Can, can I just say something? As the princess of Arizona, <laughs> there is a crisis at the border, and the border is right up in my Arizona, which was founded on sunburnt women selling turquoise jewelry, <laughs> not rando Mexicans. And that's not racist, because my makeup artist is gay. OK, OK. <laughs> This is, this is the problem. You're demonizing entire countries full of nice people. OK, I, I okay. did not say well, that. Can you, well, can you let me finish? Well, can you let me talk? Well, can you let me finish? Well, can you let me can talk? Let me because it's actually your job to listen to me. <laughs> OK, OK, OK. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. We're not going to do this. This is the view. We are five best friends with nothing in common. OK. We need to reset. OK, everybody, close your eyes. Now open them. Paul Rudd is 50. What? If Paul Rudd's 50, I'm dead. Uh, uh, pa Paul Rudd looks so young because he is a good person. This is Paul Rudd at 50. And this is Stephen Miller as a baby. <laughs> Evil eats you from the inside. Yes, absolutely. absolutely. Our guest today is the vixen of anti-vax. Please welcome former View co-host Jenny McCarthy. Oh my God! Oh. Welcome back, Jenny. Oh, it's good to be back, Whoop. Do you still do that thing where you kick each other under the table? No. <laughs> uh, ow! <laughs> You've been at the forefront of the anti-vaccination movement for many years. But what was the tea on the Masked Singer? Did you know that the pineapple was Tommy Chong? No, <laughs> no I actually thought it was Barack Obama. Yeah. Uh, OK, but back to the anti-vax thing. Yeah, I, I don't believe in vaccinations. My, uh, my doctor is Google, my science is Twitter, and my religion is Donnie Wahlberg. Amen, sister. I mean, these vaccinations are so unnecessary, like the polio vaccine. How many people do you know with polio? None, because we get vaccinated. <laughs> and that's your opinion. But, 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 but what about the measles outbreak? I mean, you have to vaccinate your kids. Well, I think Reddit would disagree, and that's why I am organizing a rally against measles with all the people who aren't vaccinated, hundreds of us in a big group marching down the center of the city. OK, when exactly is that? That's this weekend. I will be out of town. But what the left fails to understand is that vaccinations are a personal liberty issue. OK, great. Let them go extinct. OK, can you, play, can you, can you let me finish? Can you let me talk? Well, can you let me finish? Can I punch you in the things? No, 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 no. This is the view. Go. Oh. Oh.